Warning, this video contains a large amount of shade. Hello, another video about a award show I wasn't invited to. I'm doing great in life. What's up guys, it's Blair, and in this video, I'll be reviewing the fashion choices that celebrities decided to wear at the Billboard Music Awards. And if you guys didn't know, the Billboard Music Awards just started airing a couple years ago. They used to air in the early 2000s, but then it stopped and then came back like Britney Spears. No shade. Like the opening of this video said, this video contains a lot of shade. Yes, it will contain a lot of love, a lot of shade, a lot of making fun of celebrities. But what more can you expect? I mean, what do you expect me to do? Just be nice to everyone? No, I can't do that. If you wore something terrible, I have to let you know. You guys should definitely subscribe to this channel after watching this video. Actually, you guys should actually pause this video right now and go subscribe to my channel. If you're on a mobile device, you can scroll down and subscribe. And if you are on a desktop or a laptop, you can subscribe right here. Do it. So without further ado, let's get started with Miss Britney Spears. So Britney opened the Billboard Music Awards this year and she sang very well. It was like they just played a CD and she performed with it. So Britney is wearing this lace dress. I like the long shoes. I like how it's like laced up. Britney really worked it. Britney needs to stop with all the plastic surgery and the lip injections before she ends up looking like Donatella Versace. But you guys didn't hear that from me. I'm just giving her a little advice. Britney looks very good. Her body is in shape. Her singing is doing pretty good. Um, her dancing is phenomenal. Her shoes look good, the dress is good, the hair is good, but yeah, the lips are getting really big and I'm sure it's from all the dental work. A lot of the whole quotation marks when it comes to Britney. Demi Lovato. Okay, I like this look. The only thing I do not like about this look is the gloves. You don't need the gloves. You look like you're about to go boxing, okay? Shawn Mendes. Shawn Mendes looks like he was in Twilight 1, 2, and 3. He looks like he's Edward's little brother. He's pale as hell. I don't remember Shawn Mendes looking this pale, and no offense to all the pale people out there. Listen, I am half white. I understand, because I have some white family that is pale as hell, okay? Now, you're not alone. Kesha. I actually like this. So Kesha is wearing this get-up suit, and it's very Mr. Miyagi meets Joan Jett. I really like it. It's very, it's very daring. Nick Jonas. Oh, honestly, I just picked this picture because I just wanted to stare at him. Sorry. So this picture looks like it could be for the new season of Real Housewives of Atlanta. And you know the biggest divas from the group by looking at who's looking at the photographer and who's looking away at the other people. The one in the middle and the one on the right, they are ready to go. They are ready to start their solo career. So Seal, um, the shoes don't, it didn't need to happen, Seal. What are those? Laverne Cox is giving me life, okay? Definitely on my best dress list, definitely. Laverne, listen, okay, you are a bad bitch, okay? Laverne Cox is killing it. I love you on Orange is the New Black, okay? And I love you on the red carpet because Laverne never fails. Steven Tyler in this suit makes me want to say Beetlejuice three times. The suit is very Beetlejuice, Jailhouse Rock. Rihanna, you better work, 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 work. So Rihanna didn't just kill her performance at the Billboard Music Awards, but she slayed the red carpet, okay? Rihanna I swear, every single award show, Rihanna brings it. Rihanna, I love the shoulder pads. I mean, that one ring is my entire tuition all four years. Zendaya is just giving me life on the red carpet. So in my iHeartRadio fashion review, I gave Zendaya a very bad review on her red carpet outfit because what she was wearing literally looked like the red carpet. But at the Billboard Music Awards, Zendaya brought it hands down, literally best dress list, obviously. Beyonce better watch out because her best friend Kelly is bringing it. Ooh, and she's bootylicious. Okay, Destiny's Child number two. It looks uncomfortable, Kiki. Your outfit looks, it hurts me. It looks like you're, it looks like you're a robot. The shoes don't even go with the dress, Kiki. I, Kiki, I need you to get it together because this isn't, it's, it's not working, it's not working. Oh, you guys better be careful because a dangerous woman's on the loose. <laughs> Get it because that's what her new album's called, Dangerous Woman, Ariana Grande. Get it now on iTunes because it's really good and I love it. And she's not sponsoring this video, but I thought, hey, I'd give her a shout out because I really like it. <sighs> Ariana Grande. Oh, something about you. <laughs> love this outfit. I think it's very different from any of the other outfits. DNCE. Um, 
Um, the guy all the way on the right looks like he belongs in Dragon Ball Z. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up and be sure to comment below. I want to know who you guys thought was the best and worst dress. Let's have a conversation. Let's just keep it real, okay? Let's just keep it real. If you want to be shady, be shady. You know what? Just be yourself. You guys should really subscribe. And I'm not trying to bribe you with my charming good looks. Until the next video, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. So usually stars walk the red carpet, but Zendaya decided to wear it. And I actually like it, surprisingly, but it's not red carpet material. I mean, it is, but it's not. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, she should have not have worn this at the red carpet, even though she's pretty much wearing the red carpet.